Sheer! Thank you for the raid! Welcome, Sheer. Sheer. Sheer Skateers. Sheer Knights. Sheer. Sheer Folk. The Sheer Folk. <laughs> Hello, friends. <clears throat> Excuse me. Pardon my throat. Still not 100%. Ah! It's raining me. Hallelujah, it's raining me. Hold on. My tracking's all wonka donk. Let me fix that. Let me fix that shit. Mm, calibrating. It's up. <laughs> I think that worked. <laughs> hello. Hello, yes, Cannon Varder. You were first. You were first today. Huzzah. Though it be close to the end of the month. But uh, he's currently on a three stream streak. Thank you for your support. Welcome, Raiders. My name is Luna Mira. I am a, I'm a, I am an alien in a human shaped meat suit. And I am here. Uh, I'm at the point in my surgical recovery where I am not in pain, but I am very itchy. Because uh, as you can imagine, uh, if, if like when you scuff your knee and it starts to itch as it's healing, when you have holes in your abdomen, now you're itching at multiple levels and multiple layers. I'm itchy. I can feel itchy from the inside out. It's fun. We're fun. We're having a fun time here. <laughs> uh, so, uh, but uh, my my wounds are healing nicely. They're they are not oozing any sort of mysterious pus, and I myself am in a much better mood. Uh, <clears throat> I have worked through the all ten oxy pills that I was prescribed by my doctor. So thank you for your service, Oxy. You got me through many a night. <laughs> Maybe an uncomfortable night. I still have to sleep in the um, my recliner, though. I can't quite sleep laying all the way flat. I have to be like kind of propped up a little bit. I don't know what it is. Something about laying on my side. I'm a side sleeper. So something about laying on my side makes my torso angy. But um... Well, welcome, friends. We're doing, I'm doing, and also because of that, I'm also, like, in, I'm still in chill mode. Like, I'm still in, I'm not in a, I'm not in a place right now to, like, concentrate on, like, a really intense game. So I thought about doing Alan Wake 2 again, like, going back to Alan Wake, but I'm like, no, I don't feel like, I don't, I don't, I'm not mentally ready for that. I, I can't concentrate with my itchy tum-tum. So, <clears throat> we're gonna do something chill, we're gonna do the spirit in the mouse, because I feel like it's, it's like, it's one of those things that's like easy to, it's easy, essentially. It's an easy game. It doesn't ask very much of me. Um, and and I've been at so much, my body has been asked uh, so much of these last few days that I am, I am not ready to be can, asked for more. I have my tea. <clears throat> Hello, the silliest of lilies. How are you? How are you? I will say before we get started, um, we have a couple of dark, dark, serious things to discuss. Um, so dark and so serious that um, we're gonna have to uh, do, I'm gonna have to get a little bit closer, you guys. We have to get, I have to, I need your full attention. You need to look me in my eyeball parts. Um, so, <clears throat> couple of things. First thing, uh, we need to talk about Snow White and the Seven Dwarves right now, right now. And I'm not talking about any, like, new remakes. I'm talking about the OG Disney. Maybe that's not really the OG. You could argue that the original fairy tales. Did. But the the OG animated Disney version, the Snow White and the Seven Dwarves of, of that fame, of Disney fame. Um, we need to talk about it right now. Um, somehow, Tra got it in their mind that they really wanted to watch it. She's never seen it. Oh, bonk. Oh, oh, shit. Oh. <laughs> now, stay with me. Stay with me, Cher. This is important. Uh, we need to talk about it because uh, I have not seen it since I was a wee small one. I have vague, haunted memories of the of that uh, of that movie. Uh, I remember it oscillating very aggressively between very boring or very scary. Like it was either like I either was losing me entirely or it was giving me nightmare fuel. That was my memory. Um, but somehow Tra got it in her head. She probably just saw Snow White on like a thing and was like, that's a Disney princess and marketing is brilliant. So I want to watch Snow White. So I was like, fine. 
But my policy with movies, regardless of whether I am 100% certain that they are age appropriate or not, is to watch them with her first. Um, and this is because sometimes there are things that happen that are, might be confusing to a four-year-old and I want to be there to like explain them a little bit or like put them in context a little bit. And that's just my thing. So we're like, okay, we can finally watch it. I'll watch it with you. Um, now, we, I know it's like popular to be like rip Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs apart. They're like, oh, it's, it's, it's bad for, it's bad for uh, like tradition. It's like, what's, what am I trying to say? It's like, uh, it's uh, like, it gives a bad, like, it's a bad influence on girls because it's like, oh, this woman comes in and, and she cleans up after these sloppy men and it's, it's all sexist and like she's got to do all the housework and that's why she can stay and like the the and it's saying that like these men can't take care of themselves and it's all blah 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 um i think that's low hanging fruit i don't think that there's any more value to be there's no insight uh to be gleaned from that i don't think there's any value in that uh, analysis either like it's a fairy tale let's let's move on from that that analysis sorry my eyes itch eh 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 Okay, um, what I would like to talk about is the minute and 30 seconds in the middle where they, where the dwarves waterboard Grumpy. I would like to talk about that. I would like to talk about why we don't talk about that part as often as we should. Yeah, so in co to put it into to the story into context for those of you who have either never seen it or it's been a while, after uh, Snow White uh, is chased away from the, the kingdom and into the woods, she is helped uh, to shelter by the woodland creatures, and the woodland creatures take her to the Seven Dwarfs' house, who are not there at the time that she arrives. And uh, so, fast forward a bit, they come home, ah, there's a girl in our house, blah, blah, blah. Um, our house is clean, isn't it amazing? Because she cleans their house. She's like, she can't handle it. She can't handle how dirty it is, so she's like, she's obsessive. She's got to clean it. Uh, she also has an army of animals to help her do it, but uh, she cleans the whole place. And the the door, and she's like, I'm telling, she's telling the dwarves like, yeah, my evil stepmom, she chased me away. I gotta hide from her. She's gonna kill me. Can I? Can I? Can I crash? And the seven dwarves are like, of course you can crash. That sounds terrible. That sounds super scary. Like, please let like like any decent people would do. They say yes. Come, we we, we sympathize with your plight. Come into our house. Stay with, stay in our house. We shall feed you, clothe you, whatever. You can sleep in our beds. Literally, they're like sleep in our beds, like all of them, because we're so small. And stack them together. Hey Rex, we're just, we're just talking about, we're just talking about nightmare fuel. So anyway, uh, she, she's like, they're like, great, stay. And then they're like, oh, it's time for dinner. And looks like Snow White's already got, you know, something, something on the fire. And she's like, okay, okay, like. I'm gonna, it's time for dinner, but I'm not gonna feed any of you bitches anything until you wash your goddamn hands, because you guys are fucking filthy. And they're like, oh, I guess we are kind of dirty and gross. And so they all go to wash their hands before supper, because the 1930s. I mean, and I guess basic hygiene. But like, so they're filthy. And they go to wash their hands. And they're washing their hands in this communal tub, which feels, feels like it wouldn't it's it's counterproductive, but we will ignore that detail. They're all washing their hands together in a communal tub. And and Grumpy, they're all washing their hands except for Grumpy. Grumpy is not buying it. He's not buying into this. He's He does not like Snow White. He's suspicious of her from the start. She's like, those women and their womanly wiles are gonna, she's gonna trick us. She's a witch, whatever. He's like not having it. I think there's a, a in a side note, I think there's like a, there's a side story there that I would like to explore and we're never going to. I'm sure that there is fan fiction somewhere on the internet about like somebody hurt Grumpy real bad and he does not, he has major trust issues with Grumpy, uh, with, with women. Uh, Grumpy would be an anti-faxer if that movie came out today. <laughs> so anyway, Grumpy's like, I'm not washing my hands. I'm not doing anything that this this bitch tells me to do. She's 16 years old. She can't tell me. She cannot come into this house. She can't. I'm fine with her like staying, kind of barely, because like we're being decent folk and whatever. And like she needs a place to stay. But on uh, now she's telling us how to eat our like she can't. We she controls whether when we eat or not. This is our house. And so he's not he's not having it. He's not going to wash his hands. Um. 
What follows follows is a scene in which all of the other dwarves grab Grumpy, drag him to the tub, and fully submerge him in the tub, and scrub him against his will as he struggles vi- like violently to get away. And then, to top it all off, they they throw a little like humiliation, little little hazy humi- humiliation into the into the mix by like putting like a, a flower crown on him and being like, aren't you so pretty? Don't you smell so pretty? Ha ha ha, isn't it funny? I found this scene extremely uncomfortable. More uncomfortable than any other part of this whole movie. And then they just go off and they have dinner. And we don't we don't ever address the fact that, that we forcibly made some, that we waterboarded this poor man who did not want to bathe um, because they wanted to eat soup that was being forced upon them by the person that they don't have to take care of, by the way, but are being kind and letting them, like, taking care of them. (laughs) The kind of things you uncovered 20 years later in therapy. Right? I forgot. I had blocked this out. I had blocked this part out entirely. Now, uh, Tra did ask during the scene, like, what are, she's like, what are they doing? (laughs) And I'm like, I tried to explain it in the way that I think the filmmakers intended to be understood, which is he has to wash his hands or he can't have dinner because you have to wash your hands before you eat dinner. And Grumpy doesn't want to wash his hands. So the other dwarves are making him wash his hands and also everything else. (laughs) It's a lot. I think I feel like, and I did say out loud, I said, it feels like they went overboard. (laughs) I voiced my, my, my worry, but like, it's, it's like, we're all worried about like the ramifications of like gender sta- uh, gender stereotypes for the story, and we're completely ignoring like the, the waterboarding part of that. That was crazy, crazy bananas. Um, so we watched it, and she has not asked to see it again, which I'm relieved by. <laughs> I was like, okay, she's seen it, she's had that. I watched Snow White once, experience as a child, and I don't need to see it again. Until inevitably, it inevitably, if she has children and they want to see the old Snow White, she will also have to relive the waterboarding of Grumpy. See, <laughs> so that's the first thing I wanted to like. I needed to unpack that. I needed to relieve the pride because I can't talk to her about it. Like I can't have this conversation with her. That's that's not healthy. Um, but I can have that conversation with the internet. <laughs> so. Um, the second thing that I would like to talk about is that I, um, due to recent, like, discoveries about old, the old internet, like LiveJournal and Tumblr, like old Tumblr and old LiveJournal, uh, LiveJournal is still around, by the way, I didn't realize they were still around. Um, I've been watching these videos with pe- some people in the Discord recently that are, like, these deep dives into strange, um, subcultures and controversies and conspiracies that have been that blew up on Tumblr and and, and um, live journal like in the early 2000s and or late 90s and stuff and they all seem to the, the lesson I've taken away from them is yeah Snape wives and the lesson that I've taken away from them is that um it is way or at least was way easier to start a cult than I initially thought and I think that we need to start a VTuber call. Don't worry, after this video is over, I'll scrub the VOD. Don't worry about it. So I'm going to need your guys' help to kind of construct this, because it has to be believable in, in of course, the same way that Snape wives are super, super believable. Or the, or the Hobbit, uh, um, the gay, the gay Hobbit, um, uh, what's it called? Um, bit of, bit of Earth. Luna, I gotta go to bed because I work at 7 a.m. tomorrow and I've already stayed up too late, but I gotta take a shower. And I'll join you in a YouTube cult because I trust Luna with my life. <laughs> that was a really long way of saying hi, goodbye. <laughs> but have a good night, Lucas. You will, we will, you will not be in charge of communication in the cult. I'll find a special job for you, Lucas. Don't worry. Um, and also, so here's what I'm thinking. It can't be... I'm a space alien and there's already like alien-based cults so we've already kind of got the makings of a real of a we've got a solid bound like we've got a solid foundation for that yeah but i said it a long way because i love luna and want her to know that i'll go to bed go to bed (laughs) 
stop yelling at me. I'll yell back. Um, it can't be about me. Like, it can't be like I'm not the charismatic leader. One, because I'm not charismatic, but two, because it's too, it's too obvious. I can't start my own cult. My, or at least not, like, obviously. It has to sort of, or, it seem to, it seems to, it has to appear to organically emerge up around me. Um, and so, <laughs> our folks. <laughs> so here's what we're gonna do. It's gotta be modbot based. You've gotta be, go to bed, Locus! Modbot the holy, exactly. We gotta do, it's gotta be a modbot based cult. It's gotta be godbot, modbot, you know, that thing. So, um, we're gonna do that. So he's gotta be, but he can be, but he has to be very mysterious. Which is good because he hardly ever does a stream anymore, so it works. He only has to periodically show up and he has to barely, actually it's better if he barely says anything at all. The less, the better. Um, and then we've got to like construct the rules of the cult and like what it takes to be a member of the cult and what it, what devotions look like. What does it look like to be devoted to the mod bot? And in the VTuber sphere, the best way I can think of is Skeb. So you shower, but like, because we want to keep it affordable for all of our members, we have to make it like cheap, crappy scab to begin with. Despite being a short social battery girl, but I have to remind you that you, you're cracked, you're cracked when it comes to social interaction. <laughs> Every day is leg day in, in the, in the cult. Yep. It's leg day. Yeah. Uh, every day is leg day. Um, you need to earn your way into the inner circle of the cult by making, by, by presenting Skeb to either, um, to myself or to Modbot. And I will be sort of like, I will, my role will be as like the prophet. I'm like the prophetess, right? I can like speak, uh, for, I am like the, I'm like Gabriel in this metaphor. Like I am the voice of the divine. I speak for the divine. And so all, all of it comes through me. So that's kind of where I harness my power. I'm not the object of devotion, but you have to appease me in order to gain the, the, the favor of the mod bot. Um, so, so, and you can also lose favor. Like if I, if you, if you make the mod bot or the pre, the, the prophetess angry, then um, you will be kicked out of the, the, the inner circle, right? You'll be kicked out of the cult. But because everybody, because we want to like, we don't want to like kick out, kick out permanently. We want to like keep people asking for more, right? You kick them out and you put them, you create a different, a different discord server, which is sort of like, we call them like the, the, the banished, the excommunicated server where that people who've been excommunicated go. And we might even put a couple of you in there to just to, to begin with, not because you've done anything wrong, but just to drum up, you know, legitimacy. So like, let's say we put Lucas, we're definitely putting Lucas and like prescription hipster, we put you guys in there, right? You're in the, you're in like the, the bargain bin, uh, reject pile discord for, uh, this cult, which we have to come up with a snazzy name for. Uh, and let's say you want to, you, you have, so you get this exclusivity. There's this exclusivity factor of like, you're, you're rejected, but you're still, uh, you're still able to get, <laughs> you're still able to get a favor back. <laughs> Hello, Grimshaw. You're here. You've arrived just in time for the cult talk. You're you're oh well, thank you for following Camp Luna. It's becoming a cult. It's becoming a cult. We're gonna make so much money and get so much scab. It's gonna be great. How was your stream? <laughs> Garnic phone? I love Garnic phone. Uh, I struggle to get my community to play with me because they're all self-conscious about drawing. And I'm like, that's not the point. <laughs> Hello everyone, welcome to Camp Luna. I am a, an alien in a meat suit, in a human shaped meat suit. And I have decided that um, after three whole years of streaming that I think it's about time I started a cult. So we're just working out the details. If you'd like to be a part of it, don't worry about it. You, we, we're, 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 we're gonna work out the kinks. Um, or we're gonna work in some other kinks, eh? Eh? <laughs> so here's what we're gonna, so, so there's the reject discord, right? Now, if you want to return to the inner circle of the cult, you have to have like, you have to do like a big spend on, not like on a gift or anything, but like on a really sexy skeb. Like you have to get like this, like a like a $200 skeb. And then once you pay the $200 skeb, you, uh, it, it, it's sort of like, we do this ceremony online where it's presented in the Discord or in the DMs to, to me, the prophetess. And I sort of channel the mod bot. 
I channeled the mod bot and and I threw mysticism and crystals or something and you know whatever lots of alcohol and I uh, inform you of whether the mod bot is pleased with your offering and if the mod bot is pleased you are allowed uh, into the inner into back into the inner sanctum if you will um <laughs> no idea what's going on but I'm this is perfect this is exactly what you need you don't it's the less you know the better Lest you understand the better. This is how cults start. Oh, thank you for the follow, Grimshaw. You go, you grab yourself a bunk here at Camp Luna. There, it is a cozy place. We have macaroni and cheese, and in the in the canteen, we also have uh, free water, uh, courtesy of the pond. Uh, don't let the color uh, deter, deter you. The moss is extra fiber. <laughs> oh, skip. Yo, really? Mac and cheese? Yeah, you're going to have to cook it yourself, though. I didn't know that at first. Uh, when I first crashed on planet Earth, um, I didn't realize you had to cook the mac and cheese. I was just eating it dry because I saw people making artwork with it. And then they were like, and you can eat it. And I'm like, really? So I ate it. And I was like, this is shit. And they're like, did you? You have to cook it first. Oh, so yeah, you got to cook it first. The more you know. Yo, <laughs> thank you for the follow, Tabby Steel. Tabby Steel, another kitty cat. Tabby Steel. Gray Tabby Cat, I imagine. In my mind's eye. So anyway, that's one sort of cult part of it. But we need to come up with ways that you make your offerings. And this is where the, the question of, is this going to be a... Because what I've learned is that all of the successful uh, internet cults of the late 90s and early 2000s started either on LiveJournal or Tumblr. So we need to decide, are we a live journal cult or are we a Tumblr cult? Uh, so, it, and I've got to do my research, like tum Tumblr cult. Okay, because Tumblr does have like the benefit of, it feels like the layout is more bent, like you can do more like picture, post pictures and like devotional poetry and like, and <laughs> edits, <laughs> devotional edits, <laughs> you know, things like that. You can post pictures of your shrine to Modbot. And you can post pictures of the of the, the your ideas for our cult uniform. Excuse me. So anyway, uh yeah. So this is what I'm thinking. It, Cuz I am it boggles the mind to me because see when I was in so late 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 90s early 2000s um early 2000s I would have been in high school. Um and so I had, we had internet and I had online presence, but like, I was not, I had, I had eight siblings. So the amount of time I could spend on the internet was not a lot of time. And so I never got into the, I never under like, I never got into the, like, I never had a MySpace account. I never, uh, got into Tumblr. I briefly had a live journal. Um, so the, the existence of all of these internet cults completely m missed me entirely i missed all the controversy i missed all of the the crap it kicked up so now i'm going back and i'm reading about it in in retrospect and it is fucking fascinating to me um uh i'm lame in all schools uh, does that surprise you silliest lily does it surprise you that i'm lame does that surprise you at all oh i for oh i forget did you finish hot mod bot oh yeah uh not no I haven't worked. It's, it was like, he's like 90% finished. I still have to finish it though. But that can be the first, actually. That's going to be the first cult image. Um, that can be the first. That's, we, that's when we're going to pull people in with that monstrosity. But anyway, yeah. So Tumblr, we gotta, I got to do a poll uh, in the Discord. Tumblr, Tumblr cult, live journal cult. I still think it should be a Lily cult. Well, see, that might work for because it Lily is like could be short for Lilith, and Lilith is like a pagan situation that could work. But it's also like got some connections to Judaism as well, uh, so we might run afoul of certain corn. I mean, eventually, eventually, what's going to happen is our cult will run afoul of the internet. Um, so I mean, I guess that's the point. But we have to figure out a way to monetize the cult as well. Like, first it turns into internal. Like, it's internal monetization. Like, you guys are just spending money to show devotion to me and to Modbot. But then we've got to figure out how to branch out and make money for the cult so that we can do our own little, like, uh, 
compound. That's the word. Lilith is like not a pagan thing. No, isn't she like, well, she's like, she was, she's in, she is in Judaism, but she's like kind of like, they don't, like, I feel like she's glossed over. Like, like, I feel like they don't talk about her. Like, we pretend like she, kind of like uh, Catholics pretend like they don't worship the Virgin Mary when they, 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 you guys kind of do. I mean, yeah, certain modern pagan groups stole her, but they did that to everything. Well, I mean, it's sort of fair. Abrahamic religions be going around stealing shit and overriding stuff. We get one. Yeah, pagans get to have one, right? <laughs> pagans get to have one. We're taking this one and this one. But, um, yeah. So... Snow White has waterboard boarding in it, and we need to start a Tumblr slash live journal um, cult. I'm 100% convinced the Virgin Mary and the saints would be minor deities if Catholicism wasn't monotheistic. I mean, why not both sites? This is true. Hmm, why not? Why not spread our tentacles wide? That sounds gross. Limey. Uh, I'm convinced that we... I, I always like to bring up the Trinity. Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. No, that's the same God. So you mean like in Hinduism, how all the gods are the... No. It's it's the, it's not. It's just one. But there's three different names. They have different spheres of influence. The, but there's three of them. That's why we use the word tr Trinity. But there's one of them. That's not what that word means. That's not... That's not what that word means. But... Then you get into arguments with people on the internet. <laughs> and that never ends well. All right, friends, we're going to go play a game now. We're going to do gaming. I just wanted to have a little bit of chitty chat time to go over the the Snow White and the Seven Dwarves trauma and uh, and go over my idea of okay, having a cult. Don't. Oh. <laughs> I was going to say, Usu, Usu, Usu here. I'm in both streams right now. <laughs> Aha! What's what's Usu playing? Is she doing Arkham, Arkham, Arkham Knight? Right, let's go to the game. To the game. Here we are. Spirit, spirit of the moose. Spirit of the moose. She fighting poison ivy. Oh, she's getting so she's getting aroused is what you're saying. She's gonna lose, is what you're saying, because she will. She's going to submit to the uh, the uh, the seductive allure of the of basically Millie, <laughs> Millie Bat Batman Millie. All right, press a button, any button. Oh wait, I should probably make the but first button be the on button. Well, she'll probably lose, but I don't think Ivy is doing the seduction thing right now. <laughs> she's more of the uh, killing and slapping and beaten up thing. Hey, I said do the button. Okay, start game. Continue. Three hearts is... Oh, that's how many hearts. I don't have... I don't die. Which is good. Because my... As a mouse, my lifespan is short enough. Yes. Okay. We gotta do... What's my... What's my... What's my... What's my... Modish operandi. Oh, I gotta go back to the north. Oh, no. Back it up. Back it up. I go back to North Street. I think I gotta go over there. Gotta fix their problems. Gotta fix their fucking problems. The idea of, of having Harley Quinn and Ivy date existed since the first time the two showed up in the media together, which I think was around 1997, which was also the reason I didn't oh, happen. it didn't happen in that show. Oh. Did not know that. Resume. Uh, I want to go... That's the Chez Miss Michelle. Chez Michelle. How do I get that light bulb? Do I have to fall on it from somewhere? I want that light bulb. So I can get more candies. Woo! Wait. Ooh, candy. Oh, that's right. I can go through... I can, tra I can traverse... 
I can traverse this light, this wall. Aha! Oh, that's right. I'll, I don't know if you're here for the last time. I get. Ha I have many more other kinds of hats. I have the, the gays and the trans hats. Trans flag and gay hat. Trans gay hat. Trans gay hat. I has it. And it makes me very happy. It makes me so happy. Uh, okay. I have solved. I have to. Pro What's the problem? Okay, your heart's broken. Uh, okay. We're gonna fix your life. Wait, are you this? Is this the life I have to fix? And I can't get there because that one's locked. Okay, you are. What's your What's your deal? What's your deal? Oh, okay. And yeah, cap. Yep. Oh, ghosts. Ah! Oh, it's my bot. Oh, here comes your our. Here comes your your holy lord and savior. All must bow to. You must all bow to him. In the, in I I trust it's it's we're doing a uh, uh uh what's it called a um I can't remember what it's called what the word I'm looking for but I'm gonna trust you guys to to bow when you're supposed to bow. I'm having a bad week, Luna. Make me feel better. Ah! What's happening? Talk to me. I'm not a therapist, but I am a tiny mouse. All right, I think the secret to this uh, ooze, <laughs> the secret of this ooze is going to be somewhere of a meow. I feel like I got these already. Did they recharge? Did they respawn charge charge ability? Now, this is a thing. Here's a thing. Here's a thing. I remember this thing. I do remember these. These have strange pagan symbols on them. Um, let's see. We need to go... There's this, but there's nothing I can do with that. There's this. Also nothing I can do with that. There's this. Enter. Oh, wait. Can I, can I enter that one? Or is it... Oh, it's locked from the other side. This one, can't do anything with. Uh, you are the other thing going that way. You're the other thing, not that thing, the other thing. To the darkness. I can go down, but I don't want to go down. I don't need to go down. I want to not. These are not places I need to be. I want to be oh need to be there. If I fall it, I will not go there. I can't do anything with this. These are connected. Somehow. I'm following the wires actually. What's going on? And there's a wire over there. If I go down Mia, what is this way? What is the secret? What is the secret? Show me the secret. Can I go across that wire? Can I can I climb upon this wire or am I going to fall? Uh, it doesn't tell me anyway. I want to turn the camera. Why can't I swivel? I want to look. I can't look. It won't let me. Oh, wait. Can I, can I climb over this? Oh, I can! Why didn't I see that before? Mysteries! Oh, oh, this guy. I think I have seen this guy. Ugh, what do you want? Okay, where's your, where's your friggin' your little kiblins? Your delicious kiblins? Do you want to turn it on? No, but... So Tuesday, I bumped into into the person who cut me off from their friendship and basically got me kicked out of my high school young social adult social circle. Did you kick? Did you kill? Did you kill him? <laughs> Don't kill people. That's wrong. Feed me. And go. The 
closest to that experience I've ever had has been I've run into people in my hometown that I went to high school with and they recognize me and they're like, hey, and then they'll use my first name. And these were people that never spoke two words to me in high school, like at best or at worst, they were mean to me. And now you're like pretending to be my friend. We're not friends. We're not. Don't pretend like we're friends. <laughs> You can't just sh you can't just be mean for four years or or ignore me for four years and then like pretend like we can just talk about stuff. Oh, but it brought all those feelings back. Yeah, things you thought you'd forgotten about, things you thought you were over, and all of a sudden it, the the fire in your belly comes to life, and you're like, oh, the things I that I would say, the things I would do to you. Initialing KTS. Did you at least tell them to eat a bag of dicks? Oh, speaking of eating a bag of dicks, I have a I have news that will make you feel better. It'll make you feel even more even more better her when I can all when I can post <laughs> when I can post the picture of my of the proof I found uh, in the Discord. So m m a while back, I complained that um, in the world of bathroom graffiti. People only ever seem to draw dicks, but nobody ever drew vaginas. Like, why no? I've never seen a single vagina the entire time. Uh, and the other day, I was at the park. Uh, I was in the bathroom while because uh, Tra was uh, Tra didn't want to come in the stall because Tra doesn't like the sound the toilet makes, and that's fair. So she stayed outside the stall. But I got in the stall and I closed the door, and on the back of the stall was a drawing of a penis and the drawing of a vagina. I had, it was terrible, of course. There always are, like, these drawings. But I was so excited that somebody had bothered to put a little bit of equality in their in their graffiti. So I took a picture. And I have to post it so I can get it off my phone before I accidentally show it to someone that I shouldn't. Who might you be? Uh, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a gay trans rat. Uh, a crat? <laughs> Mood. <laughs> I'm a gay trans rat, and I don't know what to do with myself, but I got a cool hat. I would gladly accept your aid. It's been a crack, crack, crack parent of the pants, bitch, crack, crack. Power multiple kiblins. It's linked to a series of small electrical boxes. Yeah, hmm. It's this so awful thunderstorm. Crack, crack, crack. Security code for each box. Unfortunately, this setup is quite messy, as you can see. Would you have time right now to... Ass oh, it's a puzzle, I guess. Give Kissinger, Kiss Kissinger the correct code. Let me explain a little bit more about those boxes. You need to reboot three boxes. We will do them one by one, if you don't mind. Ahem, and let's, let's begin with this one. See these three symbols on this box? Xbox. Uh, green Teletubby, and fast forward. There should be another box at the other end of this wire, starting with the, from that. I need you to find the code coming from it. Oh, I see. Once you find the the green Teletubby code, walking is too is too tiring for my own leg. Okay. Green Teletubby code. Well, investigate investigate oh wait well these don't oh wait so I, I gotta follow the what okay let's follow the wire it goes up down and down again and this way and up again and over and a little down and then it goes whoop de floop it's this one it's this one nine 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 eight nine 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 eight <laughs> Nine 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 eight. Boop. Do it. Take it. Tell me I'm wrong. They always do. Okay, let's try. Do it. Make it do. Yay! He's got spectacles, and he's got crow's feet. He's an aging, uh, spark. Oh, the Kiplins get old. 
They age. Does that mean they die? That's spooky. Uh, cool. And am I supposed to follow you now? Uh-huh. And we need the code of the box. We need the code of the box that is linked to the 1001 box. Find the 1001 box around here. Follow its wire. It'll lead you to the right code. Oh, God. Oh, God. Wait. Uh, I mean, it's not hooked to anything. It's... It's not hooked to anything. I mean, this... This is over here. But it... But this thing is not hooked to anything. Uh, I'm confused. Ed. Well, let's examine things. And investigate. I like that my belly is so bright I can light like I have a light I have a, a glowy belly. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. It's gonna be that one fucker that I forgot about over here, isn't it? I do like my little hops, my little happy hops. <laughs> Ah, yes, of course. The last, very last one I checked. So now what do I do? Okay, so there's the board. Follow it back. Go this away. Go this away. Oh. Ah, why? Ah, it's a puzzle. What, who is it? It's a play all consoles. Play all consoles, I'm doing a puzzle. Welcome, Fran. Usu is simping hard. I knew she would. I knew she would. She's skank for that stuff. She a, she be a skank for that stuff. <laughs> Hello. Thank you for the raid. Wait. Crap. I lost my place. Shit. Shit. It's that one that goes around the corner. Okay. Uh. And then it goes around this corner. Well, okay. Also, I have to find this code. I have to give him this code. Three, two, two, five. Okay. Welcome, friends. My name's Luna Mira. I am an alien in a human-shaped meat suit, and I am playing a chill game as I continue my uh, my healing powers. Oh, wait, I totally forgot. Three, two, two, five. I think it was. Oh God. I've got the memory of a goldfish. Don't hate on the skanks. They have feeling. I'm not hating on the skankery. I, I'm. I. I myself. I'm a fervent believer in skankery. I believe it ought to be brought into the brought to the court. Proper skankery. All right. It's a three. It's a two. It's a two. It's a five. Eh. Take it. <laughs> Thank you for the raid. I've uh, I have reached the. I have been healing from a surgery. For those of you who are new here. And I am, uh, I'm doing better today. I have reached the mega itchy stage of my healing where my uh, wounds are are healing and they're not, you know, infected or anything, but they are very itchy and it's very, very uh, distracting. So I felt like I needed to play an, another easy, low key game that would not require a whole lot from my brain parts. What is proper skankery? <sighs> whatever you need it to be, whatever you need it to be. <laughs> Don't scratch. I'm not scratching. I'm just saying it itches. All right, I gotta watch this old man waddle his way. Why did you need the cords if you could just do that? Ugh, I don't understand. I would like some consistency, please. I would like some consistency. Okay. I'll go down. Boop. Eh. Eh. 
Don't. I don't waddle. Wait, that old man. That old man. This sparkly one. This sparkly old man. Not the crusty old one in the chat. You're not crusty. You just need a little spit shine. That's all. A little elbow grease. Have you shining up like a new penny. <laughs> All right, let's see what this box is about. Yes, this one should be easy enough. He says, having not having not had to do any of the real work. The code, the final code is a combination of the of the numbers of of Xbox, Xbox Green Teletubby fast forward. Spit shine. They made this thing a bit too complex. It's cool. It's closer to spaghetti than an actual electrical system. Is it delicious? My back is starting to hurt. You have a back? I didn't really realize you had a front. Your anatomy is a bit of a mystery. Damn, Krusty. I would welcome a spit shine, but that is not safe for, for work material. <laughs> All this shit up. Nice. <laughs> see my reflection in it. <laughs> I want to see my reflection in it. Um... What am I doing? Uh, I'm looking for... I guess I'm following the coat. I'm just following. I'm just going to follow this. Follow this real quick. I'm going to sit for a hot second. I got to do that order though. Oh, shit, you're right. I got to do it in that order. Right. What's the green one? We got to do... Well, got to do the Xbox one first. Let's follow Mr. Xbox. He's up near... Uh, that is Mr. Xbox, so investigate. <laughs> O2. Oh, but I gotta get them all, so remember that. O2, then the middle one is going... Wait, middle one is going up, cross, where? And through the thingy. Up and across and through the thingy. O2. Boop! 5, O2, 5. O2, 5. And done. We gotta do this last one. O2, 5. Go up here. O2, 5. O2, 5 is across the way. Are you? Can't look. Let me look. O two five. Lost track of where the wire is though, because I can't turn around and see. Maybe if I go this way. Down, why can't I down? Ooh. Hmm. Maybe if I come back this way, I have to turn around. There. So looking from here. No. You no, I wanna look. I wanna look. Oh two five goes up and across. No, up. I think it's another Do this. Whoa.
Oh wait, did I fuck that up? Okay, fuck that up. Yeah, one second. Green, what's the green going to? And it's also going up. Oh, wait. Going down. Oh, that. Oh, wait. It was around here. Oh, that got me all confused. Eight, so it's 0285. 0285. It's a pain! O2. Welcome, welcome. How are you? Huzzah! Are you very moist? I have a raid and run, but need to be up in less than six hours. Go to bed. Thank you for popping in. Oh, chicken tacos. I love good chicken. What is okay? Is it chunks of grilled chicken or where is it shredded chicken? I'm a texture person when it comes down to that level. Let's get shredded. Oh, yes. That's good. That's a good chicken taco right there. Yay, I did it. I love shredded chicken. So satisfying to eat. All right, should be able to initiate the reboot sequence once you find my colleague. All of this is thanks to you. Yeah, yeah. Give me a new flag. Give me a flag. Give me candy. Something. Nope, not gonna do it. Well, be that way. Shredded like my abs. <laughs> she says, wishingly, longingly. Okay. Uh, and then the other Kiblin is on a roof somewhere. All sad and depressed and whatnot. I don't know where, though. Does it say on the map? It does not. It gives no indication. Must be wearing your superhero Halloween costume. Hey -o. Uh, let's see. It was on a roof somewhere. Don't know where they is do is does do be. Hmm. Well. Must we go back up to the roof? Still can't get down that one, whatever that one goes to. No. Up, 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 up. Happy, happy, happy. Well, now that these are all glowy, can I jazz? Can I do something with that? Can that? Does that help me? Does not. Yet. Oh, wait. Let's go up higher. I wonder if rats get altitude. Like, if, do, do you think small animals get altitude sickness from doing things like climbing up buildings? Because it's kind of like proportionate to us going up a mountain. Or no. Oh, wait. Can I sneaky sneaky along this edge to get that sneaky sneaky light bulb? I want that sneaky light bulb. Sneaky sneaky. <gasps> Don't fall. You fall. Yay, I got it. So sneaky. Alright, I can get through I can I can go through walls! Neato. Candy! 
Watch out. But, uh, is it stuck? Oh, pfft. oh, nobody was standing down there. Oh, that's nice. Okay, and then now I can get. Does this take me down to a place? I it does. That helps, sort of. It doesn't solve the problem I have of. I want to be. I want to be where the kiblin is. I want to do my job so I can get more hats. Is that all that's up here? Or am I missing something like usual? Usual. Go back in here. You going? Where are you gonna take me? You go over there. You go over there. Can I climb up the gate? No, I can't. know where this kiblin is that I'm supposed to get. There's another another electro box up there. Electro wire. How do I get to there? I want to go to there. Why does it push me away when all I want to do is love? Secrets lie within this spatial unit. Where is that? Get up there. Can I climb up this this fabric. No. Feels like something a rat ought to. Oh yes, I can. Oh, I want baguettes. I want a croissant. That's an expensive loaf. Okay, that didn't help. can I go here? Why is that a thing I can do? Where does that take me? Ooh, light bulb. That's nice. this take me? Higher. That's nice. Well, I'm getting candies. That's always happy. Happy. So happy. So then the next step. Oh. Oh. You don't want to. Okay. 
Light bulbs are nice. I would like solutions to problems would be better. No, we don't want to. It's a different thing. No good. What is over here? Oh. Ah. <laughs> Three times the charm. Oh, hi, I found you! Yay! That took forever. Where you, were you in the relationship to where I was? You were right across the street on top of this piece of shit thing. Kikri? Kisri? Kaisre? Kiskri? Is that your name? Who are you? Oh, he's, so, he's a baby. He's got a little cuddle friend. And it's a mouse, I think. Oh, then he should be happy to see me. Ghosts. Oh, no, don't be afraid. I am not a ghost. Should I boo at him? Should I boo at him? <laughs> oh, that fucked up. Oh, no. <laughs> no! Oh, no. <laughs> well, I did fuck around and find out, I guess. I fucked around and I found out. Mobby. Alright. Fuck. Some sort of generator. Oh. Oh. C cool. Does that help me? <clears throat> That's what I get for being a bully. This is true. I, this is, I did it to myself. I did it to myself. I find a way to calm. Oh no! Kick him in the tits. Do I just do that? Do I just give him no place to run? We stand, b bullies here. We so say the bully king. Look, you can't be afraid of me because I have a cute gay hat. Wait, I made you... Okay. There. Did I just give him a concussion? That's how I calm him down, is giving him a concussion? <clears throat> You don't seem like a ghost after all. Wait, why Why was that the undeniable proof that I wasn't a ghost? <clears throat> because I understand cause and effect? Okay. Okay, game. Whatever you say. I am a mouse, much like your teddy. A ghost moose? Oh! Oh, interesting, interesting. So I traumatized him into doing things for me. I mean, I'd have... <laughs> Yay. Moral of the story, you can traumatize people into doing what you need them to do. <laughs> we got an ooh ooh ar ar <laughs> But it'll be great with the, my voice being what it is. <clears throat> Someday I'll have a clear voice again. Someday, chat. And on that day, your hearts will melt. You'll say that. You'll say to yourselves, that's the Luna we remember. That's the sultry vixen 
we came to hear. I have an ooh, ara, okay. Awa, awa. 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 You're welcome. Hey! Power it up! Make people happy! <clears throat> Do it! No more spooking. Sad and old. That's their status report. Awa, awa. Awa. Ow, 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 You'll never get to therapy now because he's trapped in a Kiblin box. Boom, explode. Kind of it, kind of did. Make him happy. Oh, them. This is the spook. These are the people that are afraid of ghosts. And like the mean, abusive sister that is can't handle babysitting her younger brother. Ooh, a Prabant. Ooh. I want four more of those. Idle mode. France has a strange, like, power system. Okay. Check on Julien and Juliette. Julieta! Julieta! People just be... French people just be leaving their books and journals out in the rain. Look at them just leaving books outside. Julien! Julien! The lights are back! We can proceed in being disgustingly French. Does that mean the ghosts are gone? Mm. I have no idea, but the lights are back, and the rules of horror state that any creature of darkness is instantly repelled by the light. We are safe. For extra security, we shall cover our heads with a blanket, and then the demons cannot get us. So saith the law. Oh, they're lurking, but they're lurking in the chat. I suddenly became German. I can't hear anything. I, I cannot hear anything. I guess they are really gone then. Oh, lolo. It is time for our midnight croissant. I am tired and hungry, so I will get my croissant. Let me just finish something real quick and we'll go back home. I need to check a few things before going. A few things! Then I became Jamaican. It was French, then it was German, then I was Jamaican. What matters is that everything is all right now. Way to go, Juliette! Sacre bleu and whatnot! Yay! Hearts for me! And you know what? Electricity's gonna get all the credit. Nobody's gonna say to themselves, Thank God the hero mouse went around and did all this bitch work to get the lights working again, they're gonna say, thank God the power company did their goddamn job. When in reality, they're, it's PG&E. They're not, they're just burning down, they're burning down entire towns. Oh. hey -o. Yeah, my you're surprisingly adept at this, Lumion. Lumion. <laughs> Kiblin, and, and that Kiblin near the South Square Fountain pestered me to give you this message. Don't forget to bring me light bulbs. Good luck on your search and thanks. Hey, thanks, bye. Yeah, I'm working on it. Where are the other poor bastards in this scenario? There is this poor bastard here. Eugene, oh, the artist, yeah. And then we've got Lisa at the pizzeria. Do you, Jane? You Jane or pizzeria? Oh, this is the pizzeria. Pizzeria. Here I go again. 
my mind. I would like pepperoni pizzeria. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Pizza time, turtle time. All right, gotta find their little situation. What's their beef? Flambe. Let I can't I know I can't go over the meow, so I have to go over the meow. Whee! That's fun. That's a good time. That's a super special power. Ah uh, yes, give me Yes. Yes. Feed me. Feed me, Seymour. Why not a baguette? I like croissants better. I like a croissant. I like a smooshy, I like a crispy, a nice lightly crisp croissant on the outside and nice and airy and moist and buttery on the inside. Like me. <laughs> yes, I said it. Oh, I've got to get three kiblins here. Ah! I'm never going to get used to that. I can go 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 by by our overlord. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> Kiblins. Kiblins. Where be them Kiblins? Where they be? Ah. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Why is he in the mirror? That's horrifying. Hey. I see you. You okay, friend? This can't be the end of me. Well, you were made of pure energy, so. I don't know why you need a hat. But I can't complain about hats. I have a very nice hat. I can understand why. Even if you didn't need a hat, you might want a hat. Uh, yep. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Sure. What do you need me to do? I saw a tray on the ground. If you can move it below me, I would be able to land safely. My toolbox is blocking the way. Let me just remove it. Well, if you can do that, why don't you just move the tray yourself? <laughs> why? Why do you have the power over some matter and not others? <laughs> Explain this to me! Oh, I see a light bulb. I can just fall, all right? Oh, ish. Eh. Ha ha. Can I fall here? B. Oh, didn't work. Push it. Pull it. Move tray. Eh? I electrocute it? Oh, shit. I did. <laughs> Zap it. Come on. Oh, I can't. You're not You're not there yet. I see. Oh, I see. <laughs> it's a... It's a... Fine, puzzle. I want that fucking light bulb. Get that fucking light bulb. Not having that light bulb makes me very angry. Can't I have it? Won't you give it to me? 
Can't I get up there? It feels like that's something I should be able to do. Fuck you. I see. It's a good thing there's all these convenient tracks that perfectly fit this tray going everywhere. This is a very practical West restaurant design. Is that not good enough? Oh, it's not. There. There. I don't... You now will fall like a foot and a half less. It'll make all the difference. Come on. What do you want me to do? Push you? Move the tray to secure the... It's moved. Do I need to push you? You're gonna make me push you. I will do it. All the way back up here. Hold his hand, then let it go. <laughs> there. He's fine. He's fine. He's fine. You're fine. You told me to do this. This is what you told me to do. Yeah, can I have my light bulb? Yay, cozy. And they're very, they're uncomfortably close to all of that greenery. You're well, you're bye. They sell pizzas and eclairs. That light bulb. Hey, where'd the light? Where'd the? Oh, there it is. I was gonna say, where'd the fucking tray go? B. Yay! It was worth. The, it was worth all the broken bones. And then we have one kiblin down. Meow. In the spooky mirror. Hi. Hello, hello, kiblins trapped in the in the mirror. Your fate is not at all spooky. Mm-hmm. I saw some receipts laying on the tables. I was planning to get out of this box, which I am not locked in, and read them. But you seem like a field person. Surely you can help me with- You seem like a sucker! Ah. Uh... Margarita pizza. The margarita pizza price. Okay. Okay. Oh, fuck. Do I need to... I need to move this piece of shit around again, don't I? Uh, 
I can't. Can I not? You're not gonna let me do it? Eh. Okay, maybe I don't have to do that. Oh, wait. This climb. Wait, there was a climb. Is it this thing? Yes, it's that thing. Do I traverse? Oh, oh, I got a light bulb. That's nice. Sort of. Do I climb this? Do I have to get up and fall down? Oh, I better have to get up and fall down. I have to break all of my tiny mouse bones again. Nice! Such fun! Oh, well, there's a receipt here. Investigate! Wait. Wait. Margarita Pizza, 865! Hey, oh. Yes. Kuros. Hey. Minus taking, subtracting all of my employee benefits, minus maximize, plus maximizing shareholder value, and everyone will be miserable. Excellent. Avocado and banana pizza? That's not real. Is that real? It doesn't sound terrible, but I'm, but it can't be, right? Avocado and banana pizza. I've never had it, but that doesn't mean it's no good. I would try. I wouldn't. I would believe that tastes good before I would believe that Hawaiian pizza tastes good. Is it on this one by any chance? No, it was not. Go to that other one means I have to fall to my doom. Doom. How's everybody else in chat doing tonight? It's very quiet. You're all being very quiet tonight. Just enjoying the chill vibe. Let's see. This one. I think this one. I think? Maybe not? This one? No, not that one. This one? No, not that one. This one. B. Aha! Fix that. Hey! <laughs> Avocado banana pizza. It's cheaper than the, ma the uh, margarita pizza, so... Let's do 645. 645. 40. Five, six, four, five. Hey! Yes. What would you do if I said no? Would you just say, well, fuck off until you're... you do it? Do it. How does he know I'm telling the truth? Oh, right, he was doing the maths. This is... What a weird menu frame. Free you? <laughs> Why is everybody mad at my lack of gentility? It's not like I've ever done this before. I'm a mouse. Tequila. Tequila. <laughs> that other one has seen some things. Things he can't unsee. 
Okay, you big butt. Look at your little wiggle butt. Ah, yes, we have a backstory. I was trying to see how I could fix the pizzeria sign when suddenly... The most beautiful fire flag has come by. I was so captivated by it, I slipped. And in a fit... In a act of physics that does not compute... I need to fix... Really, uh, yeah, I'm giving me anything stinky sewers. I can help. Mm-hmm. Yay! I can get... You can free me from below by going through the gutters using the grates I unlocked. I will wait for you here. Okie dokie. What? Uh, interesting. Oh, wait. I can... Can I not go through them? Okay. Interesting. Interesting. It's spooky. Get the fuck out the way. Really? Okay. Oh, I can traverse there. Wait. Oh, this is nice. I'm in an actual maze now. I'm amazed. Walk it. Hmm. Interesting. That amaze pun sucked. Yeah, but you liked it. Everybody likes a good dad joke. Or even people like a bad dad joke, for that matter. So I can't get through there. I can't. And I. Okay, wait. Yay! I did it! Oh, well, you, yeah, well, I mean, kind of, sort of, technically. I have it. I'm shredded by this metal. I probably will get the lockjaw. I haven't had my tetanus shot updated, but I'm sure that there's a, a cure. That's the turkey soundtrack. Sound effect. Woo! Collect 500 energy in North Town. I do and I did. 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 Dank done. Did. Soup it up. There it goes. Give me your love now, cause I solved your problem. Uh-huh. 
and <laughs> goodbye world it's very ominous sideways Ooh. you're not getting paid to to nap the people they love me the peoples the peoples they love they do love I wonder if I get more hats after I finish this challenge And the pizzeria in the pizzeria. Uh, one more schmuck who needs me. Uh, this schmuck on the other side of that schmo. This is going to be the artiste. Uh, this one's going to be particularly annoying, I feel. All right, I got to find your little electro box. Your little electro box is actually... Up here. Mayhaps. Whoa. That's all this. It does. It worked. Hooray! Ish. 50 energy. Feed me, Seymour. Looks like Modbot, kinda. Ah! Need two kiblins, that's good. Ah. Oh, little gardener ones. Oh, oh, well, he's right there. He's a very tall one. Uh, Hey, get, get in the box. Get, get in the box. A mysterious note. <laughs> ah, yes, classic. Did you try typing in guest? One, two, three. <laughs> Examine in Bistukert. Uh, huh. 
one three one third kiblin around the corner it depend if it per there's a kiblin do I go around the corner the secret corner and death. That's what's down there. So, let's see. That's there. Thing that. Oh, I gotta go over Mia. How do I get over Mia? How do I get over Mia? I gotta go down there and go over Mia. There's a thing down Mia that leads me up Mia. Okay. Oh, light bulb! What? Woo! <laughs> I want to climb over there. B. Nope. B. B. Nope. B. Bushy. Can I, can I, can I, can I get over there? That's not what I wanted to do. But maybe from here I can finally fall and get that light bulb. up gently. Yay! I did it! Of course, now I gotta get all the way up there again. It's across from the restaurant. Some kind of thing across the restaurant. This must be it. Nope. That wasn't it. Maybe this is it. Am I in relationship to everything else? Oh, I think this is it. Cryptic messages. Under the bridge from that thingy. I remember that thingy. Two of three. I need to find the bridge. Here's the bridge. X. Under the bridge. Oh no, this isn't the bridge. Oh wait, wait. 
Where am I? No, I'm not. Here's the bridge. Well, there's the bridge. But I need to be on the other side. That side. I can't go, I can't traverse this part. This material is untraversable. No, just fall, just fall. Alright, here's the thingy. It said go under here. Mm. No mysteriousness. Oh yes, a mysteriousness! Is that oh that's the pizzeria i gotta get up on top of the thingy near the pizzeria three of three cryptic I gotta get... Where do I gotta get? I gotta get up on that ledge up all the way up the, up there. Still not open. Getting smarter. Seven five four eight. Seven five four eight. Seven five four eight. Seven five four eight. Don't want to come back. It's seven five four eight. Seven five four eight. Seven five four eight. Seven five four eight. Hello, Noi. Seven five four eight. I gotta keep saying it or I'll forget. Seven five four eight. Seven five four eight. Get seven five four eight. I'm a tiny moose. Seven five four eight. Or all is lost. Thank you. How are you doing tonight? How is the arting? Oh, wait, wait, I didn't want to do that. I keep forgetting. Uh, 
how do I get to the thing? Liz, it's behind the thing. I'll let you do this one. Heart and going great. A little tired, but trying to draw a little longer. That's good. What you working on these days? Yep, yep, I'm your hero. I want big big money. Do it. Make it work. I've been trying to do some studies and stuff. Cool. Try my best. How you been? I had surgery. <laughs> I'm okay. I had an operation last week that went mostly okay. I had a I had a bit of a uh, an um, after the operation itself went fine, but I had some day of complications that made me go back to the ER temporarily. By temporarily, I mean I was there for seven hours, but I'm okay now. I'm doing much better, but I'm that's I'm, but I'm still kind of in the recovery mode, so I'm playing really chill games while I start to feel better, build up the intensity with time. I am started gathering today. I gathered more ingredients, ingredients, she says, for uh, my cosplay that I'm working on. I have to make a, a, a Luna cosplay. I have to make this, this whole situation from head to toe. I have to do one second. Hi. See you. Thank you, thank you. Yes, I have to do, uh... I have... I'm making my own wig, which is turning out to be... Going to be very, very difficult, but it's... Going to be cheaper, and at least... I'm more certain to have something than if I tried to buy one. So, I bought... Today, I have... I have the top... Stuff I need for the top. I have my things I need for my gauntlets and my gloves. I have to spray paint them. I ordered the fabric, the shimmery fabric for this part today, the, the skirt part. I have shin guards and shoes I'm going to spray paint. I bought the tights I'm going to wear. I have to sew, somehow sew this part in the middle. I haven't actually figured that part out yet. And then I've got to do jewelry and stuff. So... It's gonna be uh, it's gonna be a thing. It's gonna be a whole situation. But I'm excited about it. I'm doing it for off Kai. Glad you're feeling better now. Thanks, I appreciate. I'm I'm happy to be feeling better too. Current location of the moose. Okay, I'm back. Where's the uh where's the other assholes? Yes. Yes. Show me the cigarettes. Ten energy. Oh, that's the, uh... That's the, the rub. Uh-huh. Look to the skies! Press that to see the Kiblin's location on your map. Uh, oh. Oh, hi. Over there. Over there. Across the street. Okay. Oh, there. There across the street. Get there. See? Wishy.
This had a thing. There was a thing to do other things here. Yeesh. Aha! I have achieved, I have uh, scaled the formacy. Hi, friends. Uh, can I? Yes. Sup, mouse? Ephraim and Eskerfrem. <laughs> Make it up. We won't know. We won't know. Tell us. You could tell us anything. We wouldn't know. Empiricum, sis. Aim compress. Solve the riddle. Oh. Solve the riddle. E C M P R M H. It's going to be something French, isn't it? Quite sure how to solve that puzzle. I also think I'm my I'm fading a bit early tonight. My uh having a headache and I my tummy is really bothering me, so I think I might call it an early night and solve this puzzle at the next juncture. But before I do that I want to deposit more light bulbs. And then we can decide whom to raid. I think this is where I go. South, I need to go to South Square. Yes. And then I'm going to check and see if I get more hats. Light it up. Give me stuff. Light bulb clue. Display the precise location of a light bulb on your map. Very handy. Yes. Don't care. Don't care. Light bulb radar. You will glow blue when you are near one. Oh, purchase for 200. I have 200. Give it. Yeah. Yay! Woohoo! I am all powerful. Okay, hat hole. See if I got any more different hats. Hat hole time. Heh. <laughs> Heh. Okay. Yeah. 
Oh, wait, is that a sword? Oh, no, that's a feather. Ha! I got a little look at my little look at her. Uh, uh, look at my little hipster. I'm a little hipster. Look at me, my little beanie. My little hipster beanie. Cheese hat. Beret. Police officer. Gay. <laughs> we'll keep the gay for now. But I am glad I get to I earn extra hats. I earn new hats. Yay! There's not a set number of hats. Alright, friends. I am pleased. How do I... How do I do the thing? I want to do right bumper. Game. Quit to main menu. Confirm. Progress will be saved. Yes, please. Alright, friends. Let's go back. First, let's go back to chat. Back to the chitty -chi chat. Oh, hello, friend. On the rooftop. We're back. <laughs> well, thank you for coming out tonight for my chill, uh, this chill evening. Um, your, uh, I am pleased to announce that your Lord and Savior, Modbot, Godbot, will be streaming tomorrow evening. After a long dry spell, you will finally get your Modbot back. Oh, oh, hey -o. You won't have to look at my ugly mug tomorrow, but you will have to come for the stream. I'm not sure what time. Uh, but if you are new here, come to the Discord and all of the streams shall be announced the day of or the day or the night before. Uh, I don't have a strict schedule because I, uh, my life is a chaos pile. But um, I do try to announce the day of or the day before. Uh, but I do lots of things around here. I do gaming. I do art. I do a little bit of uh, 4D streaming, some little bit of meets hand streaming. Uh, I'm still trying to figure out how to do, uh, to stream my, uh, if I, I'm going to try and stream my cosplay construction, but I haven't figured out how I'm going to do that yet. But, um, yeah, follow me on that them there Twitter, or come into that them there Discord, and, uh, and I hope to see you guys at the next stream. So tomorrow is Modbot, and then my next stream is probably gonna be probably Friday night. So you're gonna get, you're gonna get three streams in a row, my, my dude unheard of unheard of levels of regularity <laughs> so modbots tomorrow and then i will be on friday but uh let's uh let's see uh whom we shall raid let us observe the available victims the twitch yeah my tummy it's weird i like my pain the pain is gone but um it's almost like my, I don't know, my, I feel, I, I get not, I get uncomfortable, like, if my posture isn't absolutely perfect, my, my stomach starts to feel, like, weird, I don't know how to explain it, because it's not pain, but, let's see, so Puzzle's doing Mech Warrior online, we haven't been able to read Puzzle in a while, how long has Puzzle been on, Puzzle's been on for four and a half hours, so Puzzle's probably not going to be on for much longer. Thank you for the, thank you for, for the company, Monsieur uh, uh, Canal Fodder. We can raid Hanban Miao. We can raid Kari Chari. We can raid Cute Hero Bunny. Popcorn Parfait. How long has Kari been on? Uh, Kari has been on for eight, almost, almost nine hours. She gonna die. That bitch gonna die. Um, let's see, who else is on? We could do uh, Chubba Bubs. We could do Nebs. Neb is on. Neb is, uh, how long has Neb been on? Neb's been on for three hours. 
You're welcome, crusty old Crustington. Baron Von Crust. <laughs> uh, let's see. We could raid. Oh, let's raid. Let's let's raid Crust D's nuts. Let's read Chubba Bubs. I haven't read Chubbs in a while. Oh, well, Chubbs has been on for her in half an hour, too. Jeez, all these people have been on forever. These people are like hardcore streamers. We could read Ronin. Ronin Historia. I haven't rated Ronin in a while. Ronin Historia is playing Tales of Symphonia. Would you like to meet somebody new? Yes! Always. I know you are. You have a, you have a collection of people, I, folks, I have, not yet, I have yet to meet. Friends I haven't met yet. Hit me with somebody cool. Ugh, yawning. I'm so tired. I'm an old lady. I'm an old hag. Who, who you got for me? Who you got? Le Miss Le Lupa VT. Have I introduced you to her yet? Not yet. The name is new. Miss Lup. Uh, Lup. Lip up, lip up. Uh, you miss Miss Lupin? Lupin VT? VT? Miss Lupin? I'm a crusty old hag. I'm a bog witch. Cursed with mysterious powers. Is Miss Lupin who you meant? List Miss Lupin VT? Because Miss Lip up is not coming up. Ah, uh, yes. Miss Lupin's playing Final Fantasy XIV. So many penultimate fantasies. All right, we were going to raid. We're going to be, because it's a new person, we're going to raid with, um, uh, we're going to raid with, uh, it's going to be a uh, space raid. It's going to be a space raid. Space lady raid. Space lady raid. Space lady raid. All right, friends, Space Lady Raid. Let's go give show some love to Miss Lupin. And I will see you, or you'll see Modbot tomorrow. Thanks, everybody.